Every day, you're probably already using data enrichment without even knowing it. Google's autocomplete feature uses it. It takes the letters you've typed and enriches it to match it with an enormous database of words. But in the world of fraud fighting, it's used in a different way and is now a must-have to protect your business. In this application, data enrichment allows you to learn more about a user based on a minimum amount of data points. For instance, an email address can be used to learn if the user exists, if they use a free or disposable domain, and if they have linked social media profiles. Data enrichment is important because it helps you know more about your users without asking them for extra information. Industries such as fraud prevention, lending, insurance, marketing, retail, and more have realized that the more data you have, the smarter your decisions will be. It also reduces friction, as your user doesn't have to fill in countless forms or boxes to provide the data. So what do you need to consider when choosing data enrichment for your business? Do you need manual or automated? Integrated to work via an API? How fresh is the data you require and is it data protection compliant? And what about price points? Getting enriched data is one thing, but interpreting it is another. The volume of data can be overwhelming and lead to poor decisions, which is why machine learning is used to act as middleware between the data and the humans who have to make sense of it. Companies using our end-to-end -end fraud prevention solution, which includes data enrichment and machine learning, saw an average reduction in fraud of 70 to 80 percent. The checks with data enrichment are done in real time, giving you present, up-to-date information to base your decisions on. Specifically in fraud fighting, it can provide you with the extra clues you need when unsure about a suspicious transaction. See on. See it all.